My name is Dora Marema. I represent Gender CC Southern Africa, Women for Climate Justice. The, the women again are bearing the brand. They are not only the people who are producing the food, but they are also so directly um, beneficiating from from natural resources. They are so highly dependent on natural resources, which are really being affected by by by, by climate change. So the area of around natural resources, the area around agriculture, and the area around water, as well as health, it's, 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 it's where the women are actually suffering the most. So that has been the, the impact of climate change, particularly on women in Africa. The inaction of the developed world or developed countries um, around the issue of climate change will have dire impact or dire consequences for Africa and its people, particularly the vulnerable, mainly being women, um, because, you know, the. the the changing weather or the changing climate doesn't discriminate. It doesn't matter where you are, whether you are in Canada or you are in Africa. If we are going to be hit the most by, you know, all the all the things that are emanating as a result of a rapidly changing climate, it, it will never discriminate. But the most important thing is how soon and how well people can be able to come out of it. And we know that in Africa we are not we're not going to be able to do that. We, as I said. We are already under stress, multiple stresses. We don't have any resources for, for us to be able to emerge. And I think that is the, it's, it, 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 it will see the developing countries and the vulnerable members of those countries, particularly women and children, really dying, literally dying, because they are so vulnerable 